How serious is it? Generally speaking, a recurrence this soon after treatment isn't a good sign. Oh, my God. Am I going to go balls again? I'm playing baseball this summer. Yeah, I don't know about any more baseball, Shane. I'm sorry. You know, another round of chemo is a distinct possibility. So what now? Well, before we resort to chemo, I'd like to try another transplant. Uh, fortunately for us, that won't be a problem. Stacy's our angel. She saved Shane's life once before, and she can do it again. Right, Stace? So, what's next, Michael? Stacy, should we get started? Wait, what? We need to extract your stem cells again. Now? Well, the sooner the better. Oh. Stacy, you okay? Okay. <laughs> Poor baby, she doesn't feel good. She's gonna feel a lot worse by the time we're done with her. Matthew's. You don't worry, Stacy. There won't be nearly as many painful injections this time. How'd I do? We are getting you an agent. That look on your on your face when you're talking about playing baseball. You are the best and cutest fake sick kid ever. Yeah. I love that she's in there losing her lunch because she knows once you find out what a sicko she is, she's going to lose you. Like she ever had you in the first place, right, Dad? The only thing she can do now is pass off that bag of blood she has stashed away as her own. And when she goes to get it, I will be right behind her. Hey! You okay? No. I thought of all those needles coming at me again. It's freaking me out. Dr. McBain, are you sure another transplant's the way to go? I mean, if it didn't work the first time, well, The then... recurrence is probably a result of a few stray surviving cancer cells. It's not an indication that the transplant itself was a failure. Okay. But don't you have to get rid of those cancer cells first? I mean, doesn't it go chemo, then transplant? You never told me you became a stripper to pay for med school. Okay, I just don't get what all the rush is about, all right? I know you're scared, honey, but Michael knows what to do. If, if he says Shane needs the transplant now, that's what we do. And what if I say no? So what are you saying? You won't help Shane? Of course I'll help Shane. It's just... Everything's moving so fast. Last time it took a while. Yeah, well, fortunately, we don't have to run all the tests that we ran last time. We can harvest those stem cells tonight. Tonight? Yeah. No, 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 I'm sorry. I've got stuff i got to take care of first. I've got to pack an overnight bag. I have to cancel okay, all my well, classes. Okay, well, you can take care of what you got to take care of, but just don't take too long. Well, I'm going to get the ball rolling with Shane. Sure, whatever. Stace, you okay? You're looking kind of wobbly. How about I give you a ride? I'll be fine. It's no trouble, honey. Shouldn't you just stay here with Shane now? You are so sweet. You always put my needs ahead of everything else. And you would do the same thing for me, right? You know I would. Why would you even ask? I don't know. I guess I just needed to hear it. All right. Um, we're going to go get Shane admitted. Come on. You, uh, you sure you're okay? It's not just about the needles? Oh, you're right. Something is wrong. What is it? You can tell me. It's you. <laughs> 